Today, Lundy Manor makes its first appearance on the video series with a wine that I thought was kind of interesting, kind of weird with its blend, but still kind of good. Today, it's the Lundy Manor 2016 Meritage. Now, 16, hot vintage in Ontario, and this blend just leans heavily on two grapes that I did not expect it to be at the forefront. Merlot at 40% and Petit Verdot at 25%. Those are two grapes that you don't think are going to carry a wine. Usually when you're talking about a Meritage, you think of Cabernet Franc and Cabernet Sauvignon, and then the rest of them kind of fall into place. But Franc and Sauvignon only are 17.5% each of this blend. So 65% Merlot and Petit Verdot. Then aged 50% in new French oak, and what this wine actually happens to be is a best barrel selection. And it really is one of those wines that at first you're like, I'm not sure, but then when you really let it take over in that big glass, give it some air, you're going to love it. It starts off smoky and toasty, then in slips the dark fruit blackberry, cassis, black cherry, and even some blueberry. There's also some pepper and vanilla that creep in for added depth. Then it finishes with mocha, coffee bean, and tobacco. It's quite a complex wine that's got some years ahead of it. I'd happily drink it now, but I'd put it in the cellar for another five to seven years. That's the Lundy Manor 2016 Meritage. It's $44.95, and I give it four stars out of five. I'm Michael Pincus, the grape guy for MichaelPincusWineReview.com. Join me again next week and we'll look at another great bottle of Ontario wine. You've been watching Michael Pincus Wine Review's weekly Ontario wine video review. Join me every week as I review another great wine from the most unlikely of wine regions, Ontario, Canada. To learn more, visit the website, MichaelPincusWineReview.com. There you can sign up for the bi-weekly newsletter full of views, reviews, video links, podcast updates, and so much more. You can also follow me on Facebook at Michael Pincus Wine Review or on Instagram and Twitter at The Grape Guy. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel, and I'll see you next week.